now let's create or add another product click add new and this time i'm going to create a group product and type here grouped product and select here group product add a sku you can add and here i'm gonna add linked products so let's add simple product and also product let's product one is out of stock let's add product two okay and this is the group products here you can see i'm not going to add upsell and i'm not going to use attributes because we have already added attributes product so that's it and let's add image for group i'm gonna use we have already used this one let's use mm -hmm. i'm not sure if it's gonna fit so the size I, I was looking for the size it's not appropriate size so we can use this one and product gallery it should have few gallery image add to gallery that's it and let's change it to group product so i'm gonna add a new category here and also add main women and discount so we have added almost everything except the product short descriptions and also the product main description click publish invalid or duplicate sku so we can add some random value there let's now view the product page so now as you can see the product group product page looks like this and here you can see free shipping and some kind of short descriptions and the group product comes with a group of products so you can simply buy together if i increase the value here so this is a simple product the user can easily view the simple product and the user can easily uh, view the product here which is the product normal product for and the other features so this is exactly how the group product work and uh, user can easily add to cart here you can see it's displaying simple product and product four if i go to checkout it looks like this or i can simply navigate to cart the cart page looks like this and here also maybe you interested in which is upsell product it's displaying here perfectly that's all for the group products